조심해주세요. She lost her ligaments around 10 p.m. yesterday, which was Monday, the 16th. The funniest thing is that I came in here yesterday, Monday, the 16th, around 8 o'clock at night, and I told her, you know, I just need you to lose your ligaments. Tomorrow, she decided to be obedient and just lose them the same day. So I'm gonna put my, I'm putting my alarm every three hours to come and check on her because she's not acting. <sighs> there she's in labor, but I'm gonna stay with her for a little bit. As Clara, I can tell that she's not having any contractions just yet. I was just staying to see if she would chew the cud or eat, and she's nibbling a little bit, but you can tell she's not really hungry. So I'm gonna log off. And come back in about three hours. Hi, honey. <laughs> Everyone is so nosy. We'll see you in a few hours. dark but she's still okay she's eating breakfast and I'm gonna go in and check on her I don't see any contractions right now so we'll see I'm gonna let her out for a minute while I <clears throat> she is smelling look she's smelling every little girl I I, I think she's um kind of ready but don't bite my camera I'm gonna clean her pen this will give me plenty of time to clean her pen lay down more straw and get my things together she dropped a little bit if you can see it this is the right side you know how her belly was very up here now it's starting to drop more. Hmm, I think she's having contractions, to be honest with you. Maybe they're not too strong. No, go back inside, sweet girl. Not you. Good job, Mocha. Good job. I just cleaned it for you, sweet girl. Good job. Just go in. I'm gonna go bring the light. Okay, so it is 8.10 in the morning. The sun apparently is gonna show up for us today. Since I left, this is more sun coming in in case it, I don't know how well it shows in the camera, but you can see this is the bone and this is sunken in. She has a little floppy um, private and her bag is so so full and so so hot I'm sorry is that TMI for the people of the world? Mm -hmm. 
I'm sorry, mommy. Wants me to sit on the ground. She kind of feels a little bit more comforted that way, so um, that's what I'm gonna do. I was sharing on the community page that a couple of days ago I could still feel the babies and I've heard you know that once they're in position or once uh, the, the, the dough is ready it's okay there's nothing going on outside you're okay um, once they're ready you can't feel them anymore like 12 hours before kidding and yesterday I just couldn't feel them at all I mean I can feel their bodies I can feel the you know lumps and but what I was gonna say is that I could feel the babies more on the left side I mean for sure which is the stomach side so I'm sure that everything is kind of compressed with the babies in there and that she's not able to eat as much as she wants just because it's taking so much room in her that it's kind of pushing into her room and yeah. it was weird because I could touch it like this it's okay and feel um, either a hoof or the nose I don't know what it was but it was very hard and pointy so I assume it was one of those a very strong contraption. Time I am reading the Permaculture Handbook it's by Peter Bain. I don't know if you can see it there. I got it from another library, sent to my local library, and I've been reading about it and it's oh so interesting that I'd have to um, well, I had to reread the beginning of it a few times so I can let everything sink in. This is just like amazing and it opens at least my eyes to see how uh, we are so dependent. Oh my gosh, oh God, we're not doing this. She does this every time, every time she wants to sit on me and put her belly against my legs, her head against my head. Hi, Adine. Sympathizing with your sissy? Say hi, sissy. Are you guys talking through the door? Now you like your little sister? You can sit with me, or you can sit on top of me, if that's gonna make you feel better. No, just don't break my stuff. No. 
Hi, Dean. Hi, girl. I'm right here. Hi. Hi, sweetie. You're so very interested in childbirth. A few months ago, you were being born here. Yes, yes. Just like those twins. Oh my goodness, Mocha. You're okay, Mama. You're okay. lay down and she's acting like she's gonna push a baby out. I'm hanging out in this corner. Her butt is right there in front of my face. I was trying to lay down and try to catch some sleep while she's progressing, but she loves to do that. I mean, she loves to show me her butt and then every once in a while she pees. So I'm like, okay, I guess I'm not sleeping as I was. I just put a little towel there to see if I could um, rest for a few more minutes but it's been a long long what 14 hours now and I'm not even the one that's gonna deliver this baby so Annabelle is pretty thankful that it's not her time yet. And now she decided that she likes that piece of rock that we put there. <laughs> and she falls asleep deeply and sometimes I just have to like, Annabelle please move, Annabelle please move and even touch her too so she moves. And the usual suspects. Clara, Athene, and look who's there now, <laughs> the twins, mm -hmm. and look who's she's leaning against, yes, little Athene. I was wondering if we can move things along, just wondering. It's noon. Mm -hmm. Of course. Of course. I'm here to serve you, lady. This is why she doesn't want to lay down. She's really uncomfortable every time she does. She's almost at the point of kicking her back leg out, but not really, not yet. Then she starts breathing like that every time she lays down, so I don't I don't blame her.
Okay, I think we're... I think we're... It's happening! I'm gonna clean my hands, put some gloves... Just in case, okay? You got this, girlfriend. You got this. I know. Right. You're good. I know. friend come on come on yeah life yeah life come on you got this come on breathe here walk You got it. It's okay, girl. It's okay. It's okay. Everything is okay. I know. You're okay, Clara. It's a baby. Oh. <laughs> he wants to eat. <laughs> he wants to eat already, Moka. You did such a great job. You did such a great job, Mama. Okay, we're gonna help it. We're gonna rub it, okay? So it can be a little bit more alive looking. I know. Oh my goodness. Why that cute baby? You did good, Mocha. You did so good, girlfriend. Okay, let me let me help you. Okay. Good job. Good job. <laughs> it almost has some curly hair. Uh it's just it's okay. It's okay, I got you. Is there another one coming? Be careful, okay? Be careful with this one. There you go. You're struggling to breathe. Okay, you have a lot of fluid in your mouth. Let me see. Let me see. There you go. A lot of stuff in there. Oh, there you are. Hi, sweetie. Oh, wish another one. Okay, we'll move this one out of the way, okay? Good job. 
You're doing good. Oh my gosh. Mom is so interested in this other baby, right? It's like, excuse me, mom. Can I find the teeth? Not yet, little one. Not yet. Let's wait for mom for a little bit. Had a lot of fluid inside their mouths. I've seen fluid inside baby goats, but mouth. <laughs> Listen, look at this one. Mocha. Look, mocha. I think the first one is a little boy. I think. Oh, there's another one coming. Another little boy. And Annabelle is trying to be sneaky. We're having another one. Look at this. Uh, my son Michael told me this morning, how about Mocha has four black kids? <laughs> four black boys. And I said, no way. I know. Find it. you go oh there's your mandatory come on come on come on little one your teeth <laughs> already. There you go. There you go, little one. Let me open your mouth and suck. Over it and suck. Thank you. You wanna try to suck there? The teeth? There you go. Come on, little one. Oh, there he is. Drink of milk. He can't even stand up, but he's drinking milk. <laughs> okay, let's look at this other one. You want to try to find a petite? Comes baby number four. Okay, listen. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. It's okay. You got. This. You got this, Mocha. Cough it up. 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. If I'm not mistaken, she just had four boys. I think I found <laughs> little tiny uh, jewels there. And, uh, she is done. I don't feel anything else on her. She probably just has the placenta there. Every day, and I'm still so amazed by you. So hold me tight through the night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just us two. 